Hi, and welcome to this quick demonstration about the integration between Beyond Trust and UiPath. So this demonstration shows uh, the power of PAM, Privileged Account Management, and uh, RPA for Robotic Process Automation uh, can be combined and deliver an enterprise-grade uh, robotic automation solution, robotic process automation solution for the enterprise that's uh, consuming Beyond Trust as an external credential provider. So let's take a look at Orchestrator first. And if I go into my Orchestrator account, I can go into Credential Store. And now I can see that I have a Beyond Trust Credential Store. And it's basically, you know, just pointing to the uh, API interface, the REST API interface of Password Save, a Beyond Trust product. And once I have this configured, the next step is basically to create some assets. But now, every time I will create an asset, the password will actually be uh, will be stored in password safe. So I'm going to select the type of credential. I'm going to select Beyond Trust and a description, which will be test. And now I need to provide, of course, the initial value of the account. So. the account name, and the password. Once I do that, you know, my new asset is created in password safe, and that's where the password will be located. If I go to password safe, I will be able to find to find a new managed system together with the uh, managed account that is the, uh, the one I just created. So I'm just going to log in with my administrator credentials. And if I go to manage systems, I'll be able to pick the managed system I decided to configure in, in the credential store in orchestrator. So I'm just going to scroll down the list until I grab the one called my UiPath. And now if I look under Manage Account, I'll be able to find my new asset here. So this is where it lives. And from this point on, Beyond Trust with Password Safe is, is, is responsible for managing this account, tracking its usage, rotating the password. And since I have my credential objects here, my assets in UiPath, then I can just start to build processes. And in order to demonstrate one example, I used uh, UiPath Studio. I used the pro version for, for this environment. And I created a simple process. Here, you know, what I had in mind is, hey, you know, one use case, I see what RPA is to be able to get into an application, for example, a web page, a website, print a report, and get out. And I need credentials, of course, to be able to do that. So let me, uh, you know, show you the outline a little bit. So we have an outline here, basically, to attach to the browser, to authenticate with, uh, with, uh, with credentials that we obtain at runtime from, from Beyond Trust. So you can see the get credential step here in the outline. I'm just going to start, you know, debugging this process. So what's going to happen? we will see a new instance of the uh, browser uh, on the screen. So that's the first step of the uh, outline here. And then second step, we'll create a new tab that goes to the web console that we, we just connected into. But this time, you know, we basically automate the login process. And then we navigate to the analytics and reporting, select a specific uh, save view or report. And then we basically uh, export it to PDF, and then we get out. So that, that's the process and execution. And now I have a new uh, report in PDF format downloaded to the uh, location here, which is just a download folder on this uh, specific workstation. So 
this uh, wraps up the quick demonstration I wanted to show you. And of course, you know, once you have uh, a plugin like the one that uh, I use for this demonstration, you can you can orchestrate other types of use cases, uh, mostly around uh, credentials and. You know, we tried to make this integration as simple as possible. It's available as a plugin, a DLL, um, from from UiPath, and uh, you know, you should soon be available to test drive it and um, and eventually use it in, in your environment. Uh, if you are interested, please don't hesitate to contact uh, myself at Beyond Trust. You can also reach out to your UiPath uh, representatives. And until next time, I hope you have a very good day and thank you for watching this quick video.